graphics. In this video, we'll be learning on how to section this given view. In our previous video, we have drawn out this view both in isometric and also in autograph production, which I dropped the link at the description box below where you can check on the comment section in order to what access the link in how to draw this given view in isometric production and also how you draw it in word autographic production and also at the end of this video i'll be displaying the link on how to draw in autographic production and isometric at the end screen now let's get started now when you say you want to section this view right you want to you want you also to draw the sectional front elevation looking at it from this side meaning that we're going to split this into half right my cutting plane placing my cutting plane in this word in this direction this is what they are trying to make us understand so if i should split this in this manner this is my cutting plane here if i should split this in this manner Split this in this manner. looking at it from this direction here that is what they're trying to make you understand if i cut it with my cutting plane what am i going to see and this is what i will see when i split this with my cutting plane into two halves so i'm going to expose this hidden views so let's see what we'll see so this is what you will be happy when you split this into two, right? So since I've opened it into two now, I've section I've um cutting section me you're splitting it. I've opened it into two. I'm looking at this side. So what are you going to see? So all this place that was hidden that we cannot see now is now what is now visible. So I'll take this to be a straight line. I'll take this to just be a straight line from the top to the bottom. From here to here become what thick line that taking you can see that so this is thickened here also is thickened because i can now see those hidden views you see that and similarly this hidden line here so i'm going this will not be you see that it is not attached anymore so i'm going to clean here off just to give you a better understanding this is what it will look like right so this hidden line here that we have earlier will now become a thick line so from here initially it was closed so let's make it obvious You can see that to do what you'll be seeing. So, what we'll do is we are going to section those parts there. So, what I did here, I'll correct it here. Let me just show you, give you an insight of what you're going to see. So, I'm going to the section here. So, all the part that uh, my cutting plane is touching, that is where I'm going to section.
So this is what we have. All this base here, my cutting plane is not touching it. That is why I'm not sectioning here. So I'm going to do what I did here. So I'm going to correct it here. So if I do that here, this is what I'll be having. So if you have to section the main diagram now, this is what you're going to do. This is just for explanation. You're going to just have this the elevation. So I'll use my 45 degree. And I'll start sectioning. It must be evenly what? Evenly distributed. 45 degree. wherever your cutting plane pass through where there's friction that is where you are going to what section right so that is what will be our answer you section this part this part more section in here because of that is where my true is so the king so i'm not sectioning all those parts but you know i mean on a normal base uh this is supposed to be at this point here it's supposed to stop here right because of this uh figure we have so i will not draw this here i'll just stop here this is not going to stop so the king so so I'll just complete this this way. Right, so I'll remove this, I'll delete this off. So that's what we have. This is the sectional um front elevation. When you section it, is that okay now? This is what you'll be seeing. Why is it that the true you can see from the figure under here you see that there's a passage? So no matter what I cut, it will not touch that passage. That is why all these places here are not sectioned right but all these parts here my section plane will cut through all this part there's friction here just like at this point i'm sectioning here and this point here but all this place here my section plane is not cutting it so even here will not be there you're going to clean this up too right so i think you know so this is what we call the sectional front elevation if you want to watch or learn how to draw this in isometric you can click this link at the top right corner of the screen here right you see how i draw it in isometric and also if you want to draw this in orthographic projection you can also click this link here is that the key and you can check on the description box below or you check in the comment section you see this in isometric and in what in orthographic projection so if you have found this video helpful please don't forget to like subscribe and also share the video thanks for watching